Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Danny Hooper Edibles, and today we're going to make a, uh, an absolutely delicious Italian dish. It's simple, not necessarily easy. Today we make Roman carbonara. We just got back from a month in Italy, and you know, everywhere we went, I took cooking classes, cooking lessons, got into kitchens with chefs uh, at restaurants in uh, uh, Florence, throughout Tuscany, down on the Amalfi Coast, into Sicily. We spent some time in Palermo, got some cooking lessons in restaurants, got to go into the private home of an Italian family to get some cooking lessons. Uh, we then went into Rome for about uh, seven, eight nights, managed to get into a whole bunch of kitchens, and got some real interesting lessons, including how to make Roman, uh, Roman carbonara. Now, this dish uses beautiful, fresh eggs. The ones that I've selected today, these have the dark yellow yolks in them. There's not a lot of ingredients in this dish. Uh, this is guanjali. Uh, this is the uh, jowl from the pig, and I'm gonna dice this up, saute this. It's, it's very, very salty. I'm gonna saute that in a little bit of uh, olive oil, crisp that up nicely. We're gonna use delicious pasta. This is the brand that I like. Well, there's a few brands I like, but this is a real favorite. So this dish, we got the guanjali, we got the beautiful dark yolk eggs, we got about 100 grams of pecorino cheese. Now, I know I probably shouldn't say this, but I like things a little on the salty side. I don't know if it's, I know it's not good for you. My doctor says it's not good. But anyway, guanjali is fairly salty, pecorino is a little salty. If you want it a little less salty, you can use Parmesan Reggiano uh, in this dish. But I like the finely grated pecorino. Finally, black pepper. So let's get to work right now and make some Roman carbonara pasta. Let's begin. Let's get to work right now. Put in a little splash of olive oil.
pecorino to finish it off. And there you have it, Roman carbonara. Just the way I learned to make it in Rome.